Wow, it's a hot one today, sports fans. This is Joe Daniels, your favorite horrible archer coming to you live. I want to show you something that's just as hot as today is. It's my new bow. It's a short one. It's another short one. I'm really getting into these short bows. This one is 52 inches from tip to tip. 51 inches knock to knock or thereabouts. And the riser is just under 12 inches. It's 39 pounds at my draw of about 27. And how nice is this, huh? I even put some snakeskin that I had left over from some boots that I no longer wear. Isn't that beautiful, huh? Isn't that nice? This is a little bit more in line of what I was trying to accomplish when I was making my super mag because the brace height here is only nine inches, nine and a quarter to nine inches, which is what the brace height is supposed to be. Uh, it's not 48 inches, it's 49 inches from knock to knock, but that's okay. I just have to make a new string. This one's beat up. Even the finger savers are screwed up. As you can see, I got tape on them, hold them together. They're splitting apart. But huh, is that nice or what? I really like it. I think it turned out good. And to be honest with you, this bow, I almost completely trashed. I had a real tough time getting the limbs to be perfect. And with the bottom limb, the string after about three or four shots would come out of this string groove. So I watched all kinds of videos about how to straighten limbs, what to do when they're not working properly. And uh, man, I put a lot of work and effort into it, and I almost threw it out a couple times. I even told my wife, you know what, I give up. I, I'm, uh, you know what, it's just not going to work out. But now, I got it. I did a few things to it, and uh, she's working perfectly. May not shoot as good as the other one. The other one is just, like, unbelievable. It's my best shooting bow. But this isn't bad. And, of course, like Red says, you know, you got to get used to the bows that you're using. And I'm not really used to this yet. But, uh... I would take some shots, but man, it is like 97 degrees and it feels like it's 107. So I'm going to jump in that pool, man. It's just calling me. Maybe tonight I'll put a real quick video together. I'll come out here and shoot it during the night. Um, <clears throat> but I'm real tired right now. Was up all night. My wife had a knee replacement surgery on Wednesday and uh, she had a bad night last night. So uh, had her at physical therapy today, just got back. Just wanted to show this to you real quick in a video. And, um, you know, if I can get a new string built tonight and uh, take a few shots, maybe I'll post something. Anyway, guys, I appreciate uh, all that you do. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for your great compliments and your support. Love you all. Um, pick up that Bible. Read it, man. Read it. You know, that's the most important thing. Look at me. I'm just sweating like crazy out here. I guess that's what I get for being as heavy as I am. Anyway, guys. Thanks for watching and God bless. Talk to you soon. Well, sports fans, I got to tell you, I like it a whole lot better being in here than being out there. I was sweating bullets just standing out there. Um, yeah, there's no way I was going to be shooting and showing off that boat this afternoon. It's just too hot. Maybe the hottest day of the year so far. Uh, you know, I was thinking... You know, when I was a younger man, and that's the key there, uh, when I was younger and I wrestled professionally, I remember doing a couple outdoor matches where it was in heat like this, maybe not this hot, but, you know, in the high 80s, low 90s, uh, with the heat index, you know, pushing 100. And, uh, you know, I remember it being hot, but it was never, you know, I mean, it takes a toll on you now as you get older. And, um... Well, you know what? I'm 63. Uh, let's face it. My, my wrestling days are long gone. Uh, I don't have the stamina I used to have, nor the perseverance in, in doing things. And physically, I'm a wreck. So, you know, I just, this whole body's just beat up. So, um, <clears throat> anyway, I'm just going to enjoy this pool today. Maybe tonight, like I said, if I can get that string made, I'll shoot a couple and uh, maybe I'll do a little bit of filming show you how the bow is working out. Love that bow. It looks really nice. Um, but anyway, 
have a blessed day, guys. Um, again, thank you for watching. Thank you for taking the time to like or if you've subscribed. You know, a lot of you back me, and I appreciate all your good comments. I'm not a good archer, not at all. But, hey, I try. I give it a for effort. And the most important thing is I enjoy it. I have fun doing it. And that's all that matters. It's all about having fun. Anyway, guys, thanks. God bless. And hopefully I'll be able to add on to this with a little bit of shooting tonight.